How's it going? Today, I'll be talking about this essay on laziness by Christopher Morley. In this nonfiction essay, Christopher Morley discusses the ways in which being lazy isn't always a negative aspect of life. For instance, the author wrote, Unhappily, we were born with a certain fund of energy. We have been hustling about a number of years now, and it doesn't seem to get us anything but tribulation. Henceforward, we are going to make a determined effort to be more languid and demure. It is the bustling man who always gets put on committees, who is asked to solve the problems of other people and neglect his own. The author is basically saying that the laziest people oftentimes solve various problems throughout their life. Sometimes the act of being lazy consists of solving other people's problems and most of the time neglecting their own issues. Christopher Morley was trying to distinguish that lazy people in this world can turn out to be very successful in their own ways. He also gives the context that he approves lazy people and says that there is no shame in the act of being lazy. Christopher Morley began the essay by attacking lazy people and then by the end he listed off all of the positives of being a lazy individual. These benefits include people respecting laziness. And he wrote in the text, if you once get a reputation for complete, immovable, and reckless indolence, the world will lead you to your own thoughts, which are generally rather interesting. And this essay falls under the nonfiction category because of the way that Christopher Morley lists off real situations and aspects. Nothing in this story correlates to anything false and the author gives real insight on the benefits of being a lazy individual. The theme itself generally speaks on the reality of lazy people becoming very successful throughout their lives. And the use of symbolism is also a real element, so this essay falls under the nonfiction category 100%. Lastly, I enjoyed reading this essay, and the author, Christopher Morley, gave some very valid points as well. Being lazy can be productive if it is carried out correctly. I also enjoyed the example that the author used, and overall it was a very well written essay. I would recommend this essay to other people because of the stigma of being lazy will not bring productivity. Christopher Morley explained both sides of the story perfectly, and I now have a different mindset when it comes to viewing lazy people as unproductive. Thank you.